In our experiment, we had three different kinds of green coffee beans to choose from: Colombian, Ethiopian, and Guatemalan. Even though we have been drinking Colombian coffee since we can remember, Ethiopian coffee was our first choice because it had the special aroma to it with a delicious aftertaste. Although Nesco used more energy than the air popcorn toaster, it gave more consistent roast flavor.
clover drip method was used for extraction of the coffee compounds from their solid phase to the liquid phase. Using clever drip allowed us to control the temperature of water in addition to the time of extraction, which are two key factors in percent extraction PE and eventually the total dissolved solid in our brew TDS. To design an ideal coffee taste, our goal was to keep our total dissolved solid somewhere between 1.2 to 1.4%. We heated 1400 milliliter of water from room temperature to 95 centigrade, which used 0.09 kilowatt hour of energy. Adding this value to the energy usage of our brew, we used the total of 0.242 kilowatt hour amount of energy. Four clever drips were used with 20 grams of coffee with 340 milliliter of hot water in each, which gave 17 brew ratio. 17 brew ratio was choose for achieving the ideal sweetness in our coffee. After getting our filter wet, we put the ground coffee in, then pour hot water in without stirring the water, then let them sit for 5 minutes. Our TDS was 1.29%. Our coffee was ready for testing. We achieved the second place in the testing competition.